UFC commentator Joe Rogan thinks that USADA are paying close attention to Conor McGregor's recent weight gain and impressive build. McGregor is recovering after a broken leg he received in his latest loss against Dustin Poirier in July. Since then, the Irishman has bulked up significantly and shared pictures weighing 190 pounds. Rogan thinks UFC's anti-doping partner USADA will take an interest in McGregor's recent gains. But the popular podcaster also thinks that McGregor's recent posts are not representative of what the Notorious actually looks like. That's him now. Super jacked. USADA is going to take a visit to him real soon. It's a weird picture. He's definitely jacked but it looks to me he's in the middle of lifting. If you see a guy's body in the middle of lifting, it's a little deceptive. He still looks great. McGregor started his UFC career in the featherweight division but left after he won the title by knocking out Jose Aldo in December 2015. Rogan is a big fan of McGregor and his devastating knockout power. While looking at the Aldo knockout, Rogan was in awe of McGregor's power. He's just got that freakish punch. I mean, that's just genius. He had a little bit of a cut over his right eyebrow from that punch. Look how genius this is, that's so genius. You know what's even more genius? He worked on the exact same thing and he mimicked what he was going to do in the green room. There's a video of him, Connor, Connor pretending to be Aldo and then him showing what he's going to do and counter. He does the exact same move in the green room, knowing that's going to be in the fight. McGregor hasn't found the same success as he did in his early UFC career. He has now lost three of his last four bouts and is looking to make a comeback next year, maybe even getting a lightweight title shot, at least if lightweight champion Charles Oliveira gets to decide. What do you think of McGregor's recent gains? Hit the subscribe button and share this video. We'll be uploading several times a week, sharing the latest MMA and fight news with you. Let us know what you think in the comments below.